So any time that I get like uh, sponges like this that have, uh, you know, I can't really use to like clean any dishes anymore. I don't throw them out, I keep them and I usually cut them into like uh, three or four different pieces. Um, I use them as little sponges um, to apply paint. Always get a good pair of scissors. <laughs> These are like little fabric scissors, textiles and stuff. So they're great for cutting up these. So yeah, so what you can do, I mean, even you can use them ends really, but what I'd do is like I'd degrease these um, with like washing, washing up liquid, um, give them a good wash and then make sure they're dry and that, and it'll get all the grease out because you don't want any grease going on your, your artwork. Um, so like that so you could apply the paint on some of this or the other side you know but I prefer to do it on that side if there's any of that left so on this drawing I've just got some red paint and I don't want uh, it to be too uniform or too you know orderly um, you can do some splatters here of this red let me vary that up a bit and you can produce some quite good effects with these little sponges and it doesn't cost you anything because she was going to throw them out anyway so let's get some more red just dab it maybe have some red there and it it just creates like a random sort of texture um, with the sponge that's what I like about it really a few more splatters here it's almost like his eyes are just like I don't know disintegrated <laughs> so that's a little technique for you um, just uh, recycle your sponges yeah little tip, little art hack